All right, guys, the next test I'm going to do with the Kershaw needs work is going to be the penetration test. Now, this does have a more acute tip, and it has a softer steel. My fear here uh, with this particular knife is when, when stabbing something, particularly like this, a very dense uh, paper setup, like in a phone book, or if I were to stab wood, is that tip would be fragile enough where it's going to either bend out of shape or snap. All right, so we're going to see what's going to happen here. I would imagine because of the blade style, and not only is it thinner, but it's also pointier. Um, it, it should penetrate better than the Microtech, but we will see, right? Proof is in the pudding, in the action. You can make assumptions, but if you actually do the thing, <laughs> you got to know what it's going to be like. So let's uh, flip to page one here, just like in the other test. So everything is all the same. It's literally the same phone book. I mean, the same exact type of phone book, not the, literally the same one. But uh, anyway, just like the other test, reverse grip here. First one may come up about four or five inches or so. Just a quick little jab in, and we'll see where we're at, and then we'll go from there. All right, so here's the first test in stabbing. The Kershaw needs work. All right. To show you this much went in from the tip of my finger. And let's see where that lands page-wise, so you have a comparison between that and the Microtech. Let's still cut through. All right, let's see. Still cut through. And that's just kind of dented. So it landed right here. Page 486, okay? Which, again, obviously didn't go through 486 pages. Now that we know that there's two pages per sheet of paper. So 243 pieces of paper. Not too shabby, okay? So yes, it does have better penetration power, but it's thinner and pointier. Okay, that was, I don't want to say a no-brainer, but it was a very good assumption to consider this to be a better stabber just by its design. The true test will be durability, okay, the long haul. Uh, after this test, I'm going to do this another uh, two times, just like the other test, but when I'm done with this, I'll make another video doing multiple stabs and see how that's going to affect that tip. And if we're going to have any deformation, you know, or any kind of damage. All right, so let's stab this again. This time I'm going to give you a lot, a lot more of a, uh, you know, powerful stab. So one, two, three. All right, a lot more of that blade went in. That's gotta be at least a solid inch. All right, let's look through here. Yeah, it definitely went in deeper. Let's see. All right, cut through there. I'm sorry you guys can't really see this, but coming close, right in the center of your screen, you can see that dot where it poked through. I'm looking for where the paper's ripped, and I'm stopping where the paper's dented. And it stops right here. So page 718, not too shabby at all. There's no reason to do this again. It's definitely uh, a better penetrator than the, uh, the Microtech. That's not in question. The next test will be durability of that tip.